7 News at 10, starting with breaking news, an Aurora officer is shot responding to a call. It happened just within the last hour near 17th and Fulton. And my co-anchor Eric Conard is live right now on scene where a large perimeter is set up, Eric. And Ann, the second that I heard an officer was shot, I jumped in my car, drove here to the scene, was passed by about a dozen police officers heading down Colfax. We got to the scene here, and it is a massive one. About five blocks being blocked off right now. Cops going up and down the streets here. We're at Dayton and Montview. That's right, an Aurora police officer shot and rushed to University Hospital. We're still waiting to get an update as to how that officer is doing tonight. But it all happened right down here down East Colfax, around 19th and Fulton area. When I got to the scene, I ran out. I got in very close to the area of where this happened. In fact, I was a little too close. An Aurora police officer told me to get out of there because it wasn't a safe area. To me, that means they were still looking for a suspect. You see the helicopter up there. Their spotlight shining down in this area. We haven't been told whether they are still looking for someone, but this leads you to believe that they are. I left that area. After talking to a neighbor who said he spoke to someone who lived right across the street from this shooting, a buddy of his, that buddy said that the home, a car was shot up, bullets were flying everywhere, everyone was in their homes, they were very scared about what was happening. We uh, on the scanner heard uh, a lot of chaos happening. We were told that officer was rushed to University Hospital. We were also told this is the media staging area and where we were going to be getting some updates here momentarily from the Aurora Police Public Information Officer. The second that we get any more details out here on this officer involved shooting, we will bring those live to you. For now, reporting in Aurora, Eric Connor, 7 News. All right, we'll check back, Eric. Thank you.